Sometimes it gets hard working with your ex. Everything about this is wrong. Uh-oh. This house might look like a biohazard now. Whoa. But when we get done with it, it's so pretty. It's going to be a real sweet flip. Bam. I'm so proud of you. So how did you, I guess, I have to use this word, how did you flip your romantic relationship uh, into yeah. a professional one? Oh, it's a new one. <laughs> like We've never been asked that before. I know. <laughs> exactly. We don't even know your questions. Can we yeah. see your questions yeah. first? Yeah, you don't even know. Just start giving <laughs> your I'll answers. I'll plead the you know, fifth already. in a minute. <laughs> well, I mean, I, obviously, there was some time in between. Um, but I think one of the key... After the traumatic breakup, yes, there <laughs> well, was time in between. No, we just gotta get past that. <laughs> well, I have stories. So you had, so you had a really Listen, I meant for you, there was some time in between. <laughs> so you had a kind of a traumatic breakup? I would say so. You know, we, we were, like, together for, like, five years. I mean, are there ever really any good breakups? Know, Some people right? have very amicable breakups. I've never had that. <laughs> <laughs> we I hear that. that. exactly what you're I talking about. That. It's, like, the messiest thing ever. I appreciate yeah. that. Then you were yeah. able to come back together as business partners. Yes. One thing we did well was make money together. Does it ever dip back into that, like, romantic thing? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> See, you can be friends with your ex. You can work together. I guess so. Uh, flipping <laughs> homes, no easy feat. We wanted to know what makes a house flippable. What are they looking for? And here's what they shared with us. Just any home available in Nashville. <laughs> <laughs> We're right. in such a tight market. We just look for anything falling apart, a little bit together, some band aids here or there. You know, if you find it, we're going to buy it. Okay. So, so, what stuck out to you? What attracted you to some of the homes that you flipped this season? Was it just that? They were available. Yeah, really? <laughs> because they're really not attractive. Yeah. We have some really yeah, this season was awful homes this year. Bad. It was hard. I mean, 100 year old homes, you know, that are 1,800, 2,000 square feet, you know, that aren't quick flips and are huge risk to take because you know by the time you're done with it if the market shifts even a little bit you know that could affect your profit line they're really fun all right you can catch more of Paige Turner and Deron Jenkins in the new season of Flip or Flop Nashville which premieres tonight on HDTV